Juan Hernandez says, nice to see you. Could you explain when we can use you've got this in the bag? Okay. So often expressions, you know, it, it can be helpful to know why they mean what they mean, but sometimes that can actually distract you, right? Let's just say you've got this in the bag or I've got this in the bag is a way to encourage others or possibly to encourage yourself uh, to say that you will succeed. And it's not that it will be easy, but that it's definitely going to be what happens, right? If someone says, I've got this in the bag, generally, we might think, oh, does that mean you're overconfident? You think you're going to win very easily? Well, it could be that, but usually it means, I believe in myself. I think that I can do this, right? So let's, let's do a quick example, okay? Let's say you are competing against five other people for a position, right? And you know that they've, they're very experienced, but so are you. And you, you interview for the role. You know they're interviewing for the role. And after your first interview, you get a call back and you have a second one. Maybe you have a third one. Some, play, some companies interview four, five, six, seven, eight times, right? After a few, you feel really confident that you're going to get the position, even though you know you're competing with other people. Because of the interactions you've had with people in the company, the hiring manager, because of how you've answered questions in the interview process, you feel really good about it. And so you say to yourself or maybe a friend, hey, how's the interview process going? I've got this job in the bag. I think I've got it in the bag. Great, that's fantastic. But what makes you so sure? They seem to really like me during the interviews. I think I'm really well qualified for the position. They keep asking me to come back and each time I feel more confident that I'm the right person for the job. So I think I've got this in the bag. What is this in the bag? It is getting the job. Again, even though I'm competing with other people for the position. So you're giving yourself some encouragement. And again, as I said, you could potentially, possibly, maybe use that for overconfidence. I've got it in the bag. I have nothing to worry about. And then you don't get it. Oh, no, you were overconfident, right? But I think 90% of the time it's to encourage. To say that to others, you've got this in the bag, would be when you see your friend losing confidence and you want to encourage them, even when you have actually no idea. You don't have to actually be confident that they're going to get it to say it. Because when you say it to others, you're trying to inspire them and give them a little bit of, give them a boost, right? Give them a bit of confidence. You've got this in the bag. You can do it. Or maybe not. <laughs> I don't know. You, you, you don't have to actually believe it to, to say it. The expression is to say, you can do it. I believe in you. I think you're going to succeed when you know they need to hear that. So that's what it means. I guess it's about feeling like I don't have it yet, but I will have it. And once I have it, I can put it in my bag. Maybe I don't know exactly where it comes from, but I don't think it really matters uh, because uh, uh, we really should focus on the usage, how it's used and what it really means. So hopefully that answers your question one it's a good one um yeah i think i think i think i've got the answer to that in the bag <laughs>